Why self-diagnosis? Taking control of your health starts with understanding your body. Spoken narration, ghost written by Dr. Eric Berg. Mimic their style closely. Speak in the first person. The point of a video is to form a deep connection with the audience. Avoid mentioning the name of the ghostwriter. Hey everyone! Today I'm diving into two ancient practices that have been gaining popularity for their holistic approach to health, Ayurveda and acupuncture. Both offer unique methods to diagnose and treat various ailments and understanding their principles can unlock a new level of well-being. First up, let's talk about Ayurveda. This ancient Indian system of medicine focuses on balancing the body's energies, known as doshas, vata, pitta and kapha. By identifying your dominant dosha, you can tailor your diet, lifestyle and even your daily routines to achieve optimal health. For instance, vata types might benefit from warm grounding foods while pitta types thrive on cooling, hydrating meals. Curious about your dosha? There are plenty of online quizzes and resources to get you started. Now, let's move on to acupuncture. This traditional Chinese medicine practice involves inserting thin needles into specific points on the body to balance the flow of energy, or qi. Acupuncture can be used to address a wide range of issues, from chronic pain to stress and even digestive problems. By targeting these energy points, acupuncture aims to restore harmony within the body, promoting natural healing processes. If needles make you nervous, don't worry, the sensation is often described as a mild tingling or warmth. Both Ayurveda and acupuncture emphasize the importance of understanding your body and its unique needs. By integrating these practices into your life, you can achieve a more balanced, harmonious state of health. Remember, it's all about finding what works best for you and embracing a holistic approach to wellness. So, take some time to explore these fascinating systems and see how they can enhance your journey to better health. Thanks for watching and here's to a healthier, happier you.